<laughs> Robin Slim Show, we are back with Paul Ford. What's up, fellas? What's, What's up, going Paul? on, Paul? Disabled Hollywood actor, how are you doing? Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I'm living the dream, man. Oh, that was hi, Paul. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Nothing. How you doing? What's dude? happening? We follow each other I'm on good, Twitter. Man. <laughs> Paul is cool. We, we follow each other. Yeah, we follow each other. It's been fun. I, I, I don't really know that. I don't. You don't even know who I am. You don't even know. No, it's just it's, it's all it's always through the Robin Slim show when I get people that I don't know. I'm like, oh my god, this guy. It's because we're all lumped into the their fucking Follows tweets. It's great. And all that, we have a nice little that. family. We don't have yes. to see each other. <laughs> you, you call it a family. They call it a cult. <laughs> and just because I don't show up in the sheets doesn't mean I don't care. <laughs> I got a hood. I'll wear it when I'm fucking ready. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not drinking anybody's Kool-Aid today. That's all I, <laughs> I know, right? Slavo, give me more Kool-Aid. <laughs> yeah, there's an overdose. Right, actually, give me more coffee, <laughs> Slavo. <laughs> Yeah, what you got so what's here. going on? Nothing. Not much, man. Just, just, just living the life. How are you, Paul? I'm good, man. I'm doing the same thing, you know, living out here in Hollywood. Yeah. It's kind of chilly right this minute, but it's all right. It it's like 80 fun. degrees today. Is it? Know. Nice, yeah. yeah. It's uh, it's cold in New Jersey, man. It's, it's like it's a beautiful April day. It's nice, yeah. But that's fake weather. Trump said. Oh, yeah. Trump said it was fake <laughs> weather. It's fake weather. It's not really fifty in June. It's it's eighty. Right, we just right. don't realize it because it's the commies. The fake commies. weather. <laughs> Weather's totally fake. <laughs> Where's my beer, Slam? <laughs> it's not as cold as we all think. <laughs> if you saw the Star Wars movie, you could sleep in a tauntaun. Don't be a pussy. You're fine. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Melanie's missing. <laughs> fucking asshole. <laughs> That's what I love. My entire family is like all like right, in, in Brooklyn most of the time. They're like all pro Trump, but they're, they're not pro Trump as much as they are against immigrants. But it's so weird. <laughs> it's so like they're not like they don't really care who it is. They just they just know they don't like immigrants. Yeah. If you ever ask them where they're from, they're like that from Italy, straight off the boat. <laughs> And I'm like, it sounds like, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, yeah, it sounds like you're saying you're a fucking immigrant, you retard. <laughs> <laughs> like, my grandparents are directly from it, but like, they just, yes. the only problem is that they're white. That's the problem. <laughs> like, Italians are all white, you know what I mean? Which is odd because in the summer, we get really fucking tan. Yes. Yes. So yes. it's like, it's like we're only white if you don't put us in the sun. <laughs> that's because uh, of the, uh, unless you're from Sicily. The more. Right? Yeah. Like, that's yeah. the only part where you're like always brown. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know, and they're really like, they're also like slightly anti-gay too but now you know what I mean? they're like really catholic yeah they're, they're always got like they love the priest that they have in the same cat they like he's dressed in a robe and he's got jewelry he's really flamboyant and they have all the yeah, jewelry my... but as soon as this pope is like hey you know gay people are all god's people they're like whoa 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 hey oh, hey, hey oh, what oh. happened stop that you know, the... oh, my, my grandma's the priest at my grandma's old church was kind of uh, yeah yeah kinda gay yeah, yeah definitely ah. was. there's no doubt they don't believe they don't ever believe that they've no. been fucking touching kids but they'll take their they'll take their children like you love uh, father maccabee right tommy and you, he's got urine running down his leg he's shaking <laughs> go, up and, yeah, so go, go up and accept communion tommy what are you doing <laughs> don't embarrass me in front of this guy who likes dicks in his mouth <laughs> like holy shit man fucking that's that's uh my family though <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. I know we were talking about Hollywood and shit, and then I just lost it for a second. It's because I miss Hollywood. I had to go full on tilt liberal <laughs> to represent <laughs> and drive Slambo crazy a little bit. <laughs> That's all. Where do you live in Hollywood, it's man? A, where do I live? I live like north of uh, Capitol Records on Vine. Oh, dude, that's awesome, man. That's nice. I was in yeah, Encino like a for a while. Though. What's that, Paul? I'm sorry. I was in Encino for a while, then Studio City. Oh, right on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's where my uh, agency's in Studio City. Oh, cool, man. Nice. Yeah, yeah it's a nice area. It's awesome. 
Yeah, here we go. I was trying to relate through streets, but I don't know how to do that. <laughs> can you tell that I have no, I have no, I have no like yeah, I, I always, I hear it. <laughs> I always hear like adults going like, hey, where do you live? Oh, I live on this street. Blah, 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 blah. And then they get into like, and then I, and then I do it. And people are like, no one fucking cares where you live, John. You're a real fucking asshole. You sit at the kid's table. Yeah, exactly. Where do you, no one cares where you fucking stayed when you were in California. <laughs> like, all right. I tried, I tried, man. I don't know what to do <laughs> i got nothing i'm just gonna uh, uh john what um have you had any uh um, paul paul john paul uh, everybody it's, it's kind of like it's kind of like john but different yeah it's kind of yeah it's pronounced differently people yeah. people care about paul that's the only difference <laughs> <laughs> paul. Uh, what uh what kind of auditions have you been on lately um, I just did one for a network television. I can't tell you what it was. Ooh, <laughs> nice, um, nice. But it's a comedy, so it's actually funny as hell. Sweet. Um, you probably you probably seen it, but um, cool. I can tell you it's on it's on True TV. But anyway. <laughs> oh, nice. Um, and then um, uh, two days ago I did a um, they were a Zappos, which is a um clothing line or clothing website or something like that yes they want to do yeah so they're looking so they wanted people that were you know disabled and they brought me out there cool. and said okay i'll do it so i did that um i'll know probably before the end of the month on that one i think i ordered my shoes from there i order my shoes because i i don't go i don't go out anywhere yeah. i just order my sneakers oh. on zappos.com well, yeah, there you go. So they're 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 making a complete disable a disability section. Cool. And so if I get it, then you'll see my pretty little face on there. I every time waiting. you order, every time you order shoes, you'll see me <laughs> pop up, and you'll be like a fucking nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> how did that movie you did? Like, how did the short film you did do? The what about the boy? The short film for Easter it, You know, it did it did good. I mean, we you know we had lots of positive feedback from it you know and uh we didn't win any awards but um you know it's good and actually they're going to turn it into um a little bit longer short and they're going to put it out on um and it's going to hit festival soon i think cool yeah i really i enjoyed it i enjoyed it well awesome yeah I, i'm a good lawyer <laughs> 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 but um this uh we've got a um we're still working on the midget mafia Yes, I was going to ask oh, if you nice. got any more funding for that. Uh, no, but we have someone that is willing to start um, shooting um, in the fall, hopefully. That's our goal. Cool. We, cool. We're talking about turning it into, instead of a series, turning it into a short, which would make more sense. Okay. But, um, yeah, so I have all that. And then um, that's about it right now. I signed with a new manager. Oh, congrats. Um, yeah, thanks. Um, they're really cool, hands-on. I like that. As a matter we of fact, they just accidentally, about they just accidentally <laughs> butt dialed me. So hey, oh, nice, nice. <laughs> they were like, "Hang up on the other slip. Hang up on the Yeah, I know. They were like, "What are you doing?" <laughs> That's actually right. Which is funny because she knows I'm doing this, and so she was. Uh, I sent her message. Was like, "Did you just call me?" If my manager paid attention to what I was doing, he'd be calling too. He just doesn't give a shit. He's like, do whatever you got to do. Fucking don't exactly. call me for so a day. Exactly. So there you go. So I'm now with um, T Talent Management, our oh, LLC, cool. which is actually really cool. Um, I like them because they're, like I said, they're really hands-on, and there's no dumb questions as we decided today. Uh, <laughs> oh, nice, nice. I'm the smartest. So they're, um, you know, we have a goal, and I like that too. You know, like my goal by the end of the year is to be on a network show. Oh, nice. As man. a guest star, That's and cool. um, my five-year plan is to be SAG and doing co-stars so Fantastic, or guest stars dude. whatever awesome paul i wanted to ask you too i saw um that you uh you prefer the manual wheelchairs is there a reason for that yeah. um yeah because you know okay i used to say it was because of those fuckers were lazy but <laughs> <laughs> i kind of feel that way i kind of feel that way like i don't i'm not hurting anybody. I was here. literally going to be like, please just say it's because Professor X had one <laughs> for the 80s run of the X-Men, because that's how I think of him, is that yeah, like, yeah. just a badass. I, I feel like it's it's more independent. Yeah. 
Yeah, exactly. Because I don't have to worry about, you know, like, well, one, they weigh a ton, so you can't put it in your own car. Yes. Which, that's... you know, you, you can't do that. Yes. And, <laughs> and so, yeah, I don't I didn't, I don't want something that's going to run out of batteries. I mean, if I'm going to not get anywhere, it's because of my ass is lazy. <laughs> <laughs> it's old school. I like that. Yes. <laughs> it's old school. Exactly. <laughs> I'm cool, old man. school sometimes. <laughs> Your arms have to be ripped, though, man. There's a lot of hills in fucking California. Yes. Like, I would not. I like, know you were doing <laughs> And there's a hill, like the, the hill to get to my house is like freaking forever, dude. Yeah. Oh my god. Dude, I have I have three spots that I stop at on the way up that fucking hill. Damn, man. Yeah. I know. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's incredible. I was gonna ask, like, do you, does somebody drive you to auditions, or uh, do you just? Oh you no, just no, no. Yourself? I drive. I've got a car. Well, okay. I don't have a car now. It blew up, but I did have a car. It blew up. <laughs> Yeah, it just, uh, you know, decided it didn't want to work anymore. Yeah, so I, I was thinking ISIS. <laughs> 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 you got to watch those ISIS I was guys. thinking ISIS. <laughs> you you, you, you got to go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just like all my ex-girlfriends, when they decided they didn't want to work, they had to go. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> I said that out loud, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, you did. There goes, no. your, there goes your fucking you management only team. Thought it. <laughs> you only thought it out loud. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I haven't heard a, a girl car comparison since the 50s. That was great. <laughs> Look at you bringing it back. <laughs> right? See, I told you I'm old school, bro. See what ha- yeah, that- I like that. <laughs> See what happens? You talk about Trump once and it already starts to go down. <laughs> starts to get that mentality. It all comes out. It all comes out. <laughs> exactly. It's all about damn Russians. <laughs> <laughs> the Cold War is back. <laughs> oh, God. God. It's literally, literally paranoia 101. Stop talking about the fucking dude that's investigating you, right? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I want to see him, like, you know, pardon himself. That's what I yes, want. Yes! I, I try to pardon himself. I know. Somebody He's trying to do it. Last week. I'm absolutely not guilty, but I also absolve myself of any guilt. <laughs> How the fuck does that work? My buddy at work, Dana, told me. I don't that. know. Ask yeah. Nixon. I know, right? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> fucking Nixon. Yeah. That's hilarious. I love how we, but it it's kind so of well. funny because it's almost it's almost timid with Nixon. Would he break into a fucking hotel? Had people break into a hotel? Meanwhile, He's Trump dropping. is just. <laughs> no, Trump's, he had to. He had them surround the yeah. the Pentagon too with tanks or something. Like it was. It was crazy what he did. Like, what? He definitely was a piece of shit. Man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's Wait. fucking jowls on that guy. <laughs> Just for his jowls alone, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, well, that's how Nixon you can would tell say right now. The Nixon would probably kick back right now and say, "See, I'm not a crook." Yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah. exactly. See, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Yeah, it's just amazing. <laughs> Every day, is something new. It's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. exactly, exactly. It's a frightening time to be but, alive. <laughs> it's all good, man. What about you guys? I see you guys all the time. You're tagging me on shit. Yeah, I'm like, who the fuck are these people? <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to connect uh, everyone I can. Yeah. It is crazy. So I've gotten more followers from fucking 900 numbers. Like, from those girls. Like, whatever they are. From the Nightflirt girls. But it's weird. Yeah. It and it's fun. Like, I think they're really sweet and whatever. But it's kind of funny because, yeah. like, I'll get, like, this influx. I'm like, what fucking website? Did I go? But I'm like, oh no, it's just Robin Slim. <laughs> and, then, and then I trust them because at first I'm like, oh, it's fucking that's spam. That's what I was gonna say because like, yeah, I, there was a couple early on that like just seemed to want to get involved. Yeah, because they knew what we did with Ryder. And, right. Uh, they would want to. One followed us and I was, and they were always tweeting about us. And I was like, yeah. what? What? What is this? It's and a- Slim messaged the one and was like. Why did you, you know, what is what's going on here? And the girl said she was a fan of writers, but she didn't even follow writers. Oh, so. yeah, it was then really I just, then, you're, then you're fucking like, <laughs> yeah. get off of this gravy train. Yes, <laughs> awesome. yes, no, you're not allowed. You're yeah. not allowed. Like, cut Something. you off. Yeah, it is really funny. <laughs> See, yeah, I'm getting all those with those 800 numbers or whatever you call them also. But now on Instagram, all the followers I get are fucking um, – or uh, what are they? They uh, hair extensions. I don't know if they're trying to tell me something. Oh, that's hilarious! And then they, and then they disappear like a day or so. Oh, <laughs> I keep telling Robin Slim to get on Instagram. They haven't done I, it yet. I was thinking about it, and then it's I just was like, pictures, I, though, right? Yeah. Like, I don't know. You can upload videos, man. You can take that. Like, you can you can get a whole fucking thing. Upload clips. So of the I could show. probably do live yeah. on Instagram. Oh hell you yeah, man! Live, yeah. 
Maybe, maybe. Absolutely. I'll it if we can. I love Instagram. Maybe we'll get, maybe maybe we'll get off too. of Vaughn or whatever that shit is and just do Instagram. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, it's great. Because oh, I don't need Vaughn. anything else. You yeah. do. Yeah. You do. You need the Instagram. <laughs> oh, dude, I got a funny story to tell you. I got a funny story to tell you. Yeah. Okay. So about two weeks ago, my kid, my oldest kid graduated from high school. So I decided to take the Greyhound because they thought it would be cheaper from kid from L.A. to Ooh. Kansas City. Oh, wow. Holy shit. Worst fucking... Where's my mistake, my fucking life, dude? I, you know, first of all, you know the buses are not really that comfortable, as you would all know. Right. Yeah. If not, then I, if not, then you should experience it at least once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But then I get into, so I leave LA um, at like eight o'clock in the morning, and I don't know, it was late that afternoon. We got into Vegas. Some of the rudest people, and I'm going to call them out, work for Greyhound that I've ever heard in my life. Wow. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm trying to figure out what my next bus is going to be, and this lady was yelling at me, calling me wheelchair guy, because I said, where do you want me? Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. Because I told you, wheelchair guy, go over there. Wow. And so I start to go work, and I'm like, okay, sir, thank you. And she goes, I'm a ma'am. I go, okay, sir, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Fantastic. Yes. <laughs> I was on a Greyhound with and a then, buddy. Oh, God. Sorry. And then I get and then I get to the gate where they were like, and then somebody else was grabbing my ticket and go, where are you supposed to be? I'm like, well, this that dude over there just told me to go over here. And they go, well, let's go over there and look. And I'm like, fuck, you people are stupid. Jesus. And, then, <laughs> and so we go back to the same dude, lady. And, <laughs> and she's like, I told wheelchair guy to be in that line over there. And I'm going, okay, dude, thank you. <laughs> yes. I love that. I was going to say, I saw too, Paul, you posted that, um, I guess just some rando came up to you on the street and said, you just pointed out that you were a little person, like that you didn't. Oh my god, yeah, that was funny. <laughs> what the fuck? Like yeah, why? on the on the bus thing though, on the <clears throat> bus thing, the fucking driver kept swearing up and down that he knew me, and I'm like, no, you don't know me, and I almost told him I did porn just so he'd leave me alone. <laughs> 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 but he was like, no, I used to drive handicapped people. I'm like, dude, it's not me. I'm not from fucking here. <laughs> We're not all the same people. Nice. I, <laughs> uh, I was hoping you just called him when he said you were a little person. I was hoping you just said he was a big asshole. <laughs> he was a dick, man. That was just like, nope, not me, dude. And I almost did my new thing now from now on. If people won't leave me the fuck alone and they go, I don't, I know you from somewhere because of this person here. I'm like, nope, I used to do porn. That's my new thing. <laughs> I That's love great. it. I love it. <laughs> That's fucking great. <laughs> dude, I was on, a, I wanted to tell you before, I was on a Greyhound bus. I was going from uh, New York to Connecticut with a buddy of mine last time I were taking a bus, man. The fucking guy had no idea where he was going, right? We didn't know until oh, nice. he pulled into this weird fucking like ditch area on the side not even kidding you we're like oh my god we're all gonna get fucking murdered like this is it yeah and then the guy just stands up and he turns around to the passengers on the bus and goes does anybody have any idea where we are and we were all just like no <laughs> like, maybe that's the first time I've taken a bus in like 30 years dude and oh, the last and then never again that. right mm. Wow! Fucking it was real, funny. Man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, that's I like. I like the train. I, I drive everywhere. I have to drive everywhere. I can't even. You know, when I moved to California, I was I drove. thinking about it, but yeah, I don't like being on other people's time schedules. You know what I mean? I like being able to get in my car and get the fuck out of there. Yeah. See that? That's a good point. But I was thinking more like you know, well, I wouldn't have to stop right. because I'm on the bus, and you know, I need to be there at a certain day, and. Yeah. I don't want to spend a shit ton of money on miles on my car. Well, I didn't have a car. I was going to rent a car. Right. Then I thought, yeah. okay, well, that's going to cost me a fucking arm and a leg. And it was Memorial Day weekend. Oh, so, yeah, plane, pl plane flights were not fun either. So that wasn't cheap. How long I was going to ask you about flying. Like, was that was that harder? No, actually, flying's awesome, dude. Yeah. Especially if you go, I'm going to plug them anyway. Uh, you know, if you go southwest, dude, they'll take good care of you. Yeah. <laughs> if, if you're a gimp, they'll take good care of you. <laughs> I'm, I'm short. Slamo's a gimp. He likes to dress up no. with a ball and gag. <laughs> no. <laughs> so lies. They put, his, they put his ass underneath the plane then. <laughs> <laughs> Who wouldn't? Dude. Underneath the train. One of the last... People complain, people complain about the weirdest shit. One of the last flights I had when I was going out to L.A., 
uh, it, was, it was just a shit flight. You know what I mean? Like the fucking seats didn't work. You know, the TV was short circuiting. Like that. All that. Oh, like when they do that shit where they're like, we just reset you it. You get television like, on yours? Yeah. <laughs> of course. Oh man, I, it, you might not be tall enough to see it. I'm not even in the first class. <laughs> yeah, no, no. We get like the movies and shit, you know, on the screen or whatever. And then these fucking people behind, like nothing was working. And these people behind me were just like, man, could it get any worse? It's like, yeah, we could drop thirty thousand yeah. feet. Like, fucking, <laughs> have you yeah, never seen the news That's a or? Fucking point though. Yeah, exactly. I'm like, God can you not say it. that out loud, you <laughs> fucking weirdos? TV's not working. God, could this get any worse? Yes, always. Oh yes, <laughs> always. It always get worse. Jesus. Well, now Christ. yeah, it could be worse. You could get sucked out of a window now. Oh, dude, I know that. Fu- that was awful. Oh man, that was horrible. Fucking yeah, no, that's terrifying. <laughs> Exactly. We should just end the conversation. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you and both anyway. got sucked out of a plane window? Wait, what? Walk that to a dark place. <laughs> yeah, that's it. No, I like that all, all five of us, nobody had anything to say about that. We are like, yeah, may she rest in peace. Holy shit. <laughs> Thank God. Thank God she was heavy enough to not have to, you know what I mean? Like it got Thank stretched. God she plugged the window. Yeah, exactly. Out. People were trying to pull her in. They're like, leave her. <laughs> <laughs> Let the plane land first. Yeah, Jesus Christ. Are you crazy? Do you want us to all go? <laughs> oh, <holy laughs> shit. Hang on, Susan. Is it, is it too soon for that? No, it's never, never too soon. <laughs> never too soon. <laughs> <laughs> We're all going to I thought it. about, you know, I thought about like going to, you know, if, if you've been on the Hollywood Boulevard, you see all the people dressed up as characters and getting pictures taken and making like 10, 20 bucks off the, off the, uh, Tourists here. Yeah. You got people like dress up as Superman, Spider Man, and really horrible costumes. So yes. I was thinking about you know getting a bald cap and dressing up as Mini Me on the boulevard. Oh, oh <laughs> yeah. I was gonna ask with him going if you Shit. had if you gotten some more work. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering if it was too soon for that. Never, <laughs> never. For Slim, it is. Slim didn't like the story when we covered it. <laughs> he he was a little upset, but oh yeah, sad. you still got Peter. Somebody Jinkus? somebody told me that I was probably the only one that could get away with it. <laughs> <laughs> probably. Yes, yes. Damn it, oh, that's great, Mister Vern Troyer. <laughs> yep, that's sad. R.I.P. Brother. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> he can't hear you. <laughs> no, that's oh, true. Good point. I was gonna ask too. Have you ever done? Even... A... Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. I was going to ask, have you ever uh, pursued voice work? Hmm. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm doing that now, actually. Cool. I'm pursuing it now. Awesome. I so was going to say, I'm, I figured I'm, that would uh, be a good I day. have a voice reel on my, on my web page, website now. Sweet. Nice. Nice. Did you do it oh, on yeah, your own, or did you on... have somebody else do it? Do what? Did you do, the, did you do the stuff on your own, like your own recordings, or did you have somebody else do it, like in a studio? No, I did it on my own. Yeah, man, cheap. that's what I find too. No, I, no, but I'm saying it's not that. It's it's you still get work from it. Yeah, see, there you go. I'm yeah. I'm cheap ass, man. No, I'm right there, fucking with you. I know other like I when I first when I first looked into doing it, man, they were like, like yeah, yeah, you come down to the studio, it's two grand. I'm like, I'm sorry, what? What? <laughs> was that last they part again? You to... uh, yeah, I was wow. like, ooh, I will just do it on my iPhone. And, uh, <laughs> right. We're good and that's what I did, that. too. I mean, I'm right there with you. I did it with my iPhone. I mean, yeah. you know, it's bad enough. You, you get everybody here, they want you to get, you know, headshots. Then they want you to get business cards. Yeah. And then they want you to get postcards. And you're supposed to send the postcard yes. to every casting director about every every five to six weeks so that you, they know who you are. And I'm like, damn. Dude, there's the a headshot what am I supposed to make money. seems like a racket to me. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> God. It really does. It's, you know what's crazy? It's one of those things where, like, I would really love to. If I ever get to the point where I've got time and, and money and all that, it's never going to happen. But uh, <laughs> let's just stop myself right there before I get it. But I would really love to create, like, a network for, like, because I, I have a lot of friends who are working in PR, but they do, like, the bullshit, like, flowers.com. You know what I mean? Which is fine. They can make a living doing that. But why not attach themselves to a budding actor or comedian and be like, look, We'll make a deal with if you help us do this kind of stuff with your contacts, we'll keep you forever. So if you actually, you know what I mean? Like, as you grow with a person. Oh, yeah. But, like, I get these guys who are, you know, like, don't want to cut anybody a fucking break for anything. Like, we're all in the same business, man. <laughs> like, if I get good right. headshots from a decent photographer for a low price, I'm with that person. I, I've got a buddy of mine do the same thing, and I recommend him for fucking everything. Anytime a comic yeah. needs a thing, I'm like, go to this guy. Yeah. Like, that's what it should be like. Yeah. But instead, people are like, uh, my charges are like 150 an hour. And I'm like, well, I guess I'm not using you because yeah, I'm fucking that's just, what I mean. just like, starting out and broke. Just like right. a racket. I remember right. uh, early on, I used to have I mean, auditions. My, and yeah, my just... headshots were expensive, dude. Yeah, I believe like, it. And 
and they said that they said I, you know, I got a two hundred dollar deal, and I'm like, and and it's still that much? <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah, two hundred dollars. You you you're making out. And what sucks <laughs> is, I mean, have you ever gotten them and they're not that great, and you're like, God, I could have fucking done this, you know? Wow. No, I got awesome. lucky. I got lucky because the the talent agent I'm with is it has been around for oh, like forever. Okay. I mean, Adam West was is, was on there, right? On there, uh, at, you know, they represented him and that guy Monty Hall. They represented oh, him, so they, they've wow. been around for a long time. Yeah, and so and so they knew exactly who to send me to. Nice, and it's the same guy. They, it's the same. I mean, he was expensive. Don't get me wrong, and super nice guy. And he does the uh, the same kid on Modern Family. He does his headshot. Oh, sick. so I'm like, okay. I'll go to him, and they turned out really good. A good well, photographer is invaluable. Yeah. Nice. That's cool, man. Paul, we have That's to wrap time. this up, dude, but thank you so much. Hey, man, it was awesome. Thanks a lot. I appreciate it. Always is. Where... Anytime. Yes? Where can everybody find you? Uh, you can find me at um, Twitter, Paul Ford Actor, or Instagram, Paul Ford 2013 when you guys get Instagram. Swim, <laughs> do that. <laughs> I'll, follow, I'll follow you right now. What is it, Paul Ford 2013? Yep. Okay. Or you can follow me on uh, Facebook at Paul Ford Actor. Awesome. Thank you, Paul. Hey, thank you guys, man. Anytime. Absolutely. Have, Have a good one, one brother. All right, man. You too. Take care. We won't be back. <laughs> Frankie and the Jizz will be back. Oh, shit. Yeah. I need some of these. This is a... And uh, after Frankie and the Jizz are on, we're going to try to get Sloppy on. <laughs> Have you ever seen Poppy? No. <laughs> no. Well, that's his version of Poppy because sloppy. it's Slambo slash Poppy. I love Slambo's character, so... <laughs> <And> he's Sloppy. <laughs> <laughs> is this part of the prop for today? Yeah. Oh, no. The wig, the head, the Fantastic. monitor. Does this TV still work? I cut the cord off of it. <laughs> <laughs> so you circumcised the TV? Yeah. <laughs>